a small engine mechanic, Mike, out here, working on the base of his uh, Bessemer. I don't know if you guys can see, it's kind of dark out here. So he's got a big uh, section taken out, and he has a piece of rusted metal. He wants to try to keep the patina of the engine. You can do that back here, maybe you can hear me a little better. He wants to keep the patina of the engine, so he's putting a piece of rusted metal in there. I will show you when he uh, tries to weld that. Actually, the hell you doing to my grinder? That's my good grinder too. Is that right? Well, it was. Yeah. <laughs> it wasn't. It was in the box. All right. We'll wait till he's uh, welding this guy. Oh wait, he's doing a test fit. Yeah. Huh. That's close. Pretty, pretty close. Yeah. Well, that's, that's all I'm gonna do. Yeah. You can flatten it out. Don't worry about this. Well, yeah, because I'm going to have to weld a, a lip on, see how this has... Oh, yeah, I know what you're doing. So, eventually I'll have to sculpt it all in. Oh, but, you've been hanging around Road King, you think you're body man oh, now. Man. Skull, he's sculpting. There won't be any Paxi in this, though. Oh, man. No Paxi. All right, he's getting a big head, so let me get away. Let me give him some room for his head. All right, thanks. All right. All right, Mike got this uh, all cut up. Want to hold that up there, Mike, so we show it? Show the tubes. Look at that, it's going to fit right in there. He's got a V-groove, so it'll take a lot of weld. Yeah. Oh, and he's going, to, he's going to be using nickel rod on it because it's cast. Right. Okay, thanks, I'm going to stand back and let him go. Okay. Hey, buddy. Now, let's see what Mike is doing here. That's that nickel rod. As soon as he gets done, he's going to, he's going to start painting it. It's only going a little bit at a time. Hmm. We'll see if it improves as it goes. Yeah. Might be. I might have to make a second pass over to clean it yeah. up. Yeah. Right now it don't have to look too pretty. It did that on that vice, remember? I do. Yeah. I do. Remember you bring a rod? Yeah. Huh. All right. We'll Let's Mike uh, take care of this. Troubleshoot that. All right. Our little race is having to keep this warm so it doesn't cool down as fast because they we're having a little trouble with it cracking. I'm gonna put my hands through here and just don't go too far over the edge. Sorry about that. Oh, Mike!
See, everything never goes, uh, you know, it's, it, looks, it seems like everything goes right and smooth for us all the time, but that's not always the case. We always run into problems like this. I might use our industrial R260 over here. Pretty powerful machine. Alright, he's got a lot of welding to do, so uh, we're going to let him go. Alright, Mike is keeping it warm. He just finished doing all the welding. I'd ask him to show it to me, but he wouldn't do that. You gotta keep him warm. You guys will see it crap. this weekend. Well, we'll see it. We'll see it. We'll see it after it uh, cools off. Right. Just pull it in there. Shut up. Keep there you go. More. Okay. More to ignite. More okay. <laughs> oh well. All right, engine night is just about over. The boys are going home, right? That's Little right. dirt bike. Yeah. And uh, daddy dirt bike. Yep, yeah, heading home. All right. Mike and Race are probably going to stay for a little bit longer. Chew the fat. Yep. So, uh, all right, we'll get back here and show you, show you what this looks like after it, warm, after it cools down. It all right. Here, all right. This is the next day now. Mike tucked this in, so uh, all these towels and blankets on here are for uh, to let it cool down slowly. He even got it tucked in underneath there to keep it warm. Yeah, he did a pretty good job here. You know, it doesn't look good, but... He was he was trying to achieve a look that would uh, look like a, a period fix, you know, like something out in the oil field, because this should be an oil field engine, I think. He still isn't finished. He wants to. I don't know if you see this bead here. He wants to put that bead across there, so it looks like uh, that was the original piece that they had just welded back on. But like I say, he did a, did a real nice job. Once that rusts up and everything, it'll, it'll look like it was uh, repaired back in uh, the 1900s sometime. So, all right, I guess that'll be it for this video. Mike, Mike ain't here right now. Mike is uh, at work, so. Looks like you did a fine job. All right, see you guys later.